Whether performing on stage or in front of camera, Meatloaf was the type of entertainer who always left an impression. He roared on screen as Eddie in the Rocky Horror Picture Show, the first of many cult classics he'd be associated with. Always in character and overly dramatic, his stage performances evolved into a singing career. He collaborated with songwriter Jim Steinman on Bat Out of Hell, which was released in 1977. The critics didn't know what to do with it. Rolling Stone magazine gave it zero star. Audiences, however, loved its moody anthems. It's one of the top-selling albums of all time, more than 43 million copies. The overweight singer became one of the biggest rock stars in the world. The fact that they have uh, bought tickets, come to shows, and the majority of them have loved what I've done. That's been the best present that you could ever get. And that um, that they've that they've loved they've loved what you've done, and they've been fans, and they stay fans. And I would do anything for love. Oh, I would do His success continued into the 90s. I was a juicer. <laughs> Younger audiences were introduced to him through his film and television appearances. Mr. O. Bat Out of Hell was later adapted into an over-the-top award-winning musical, which is currently touring the United Kingdom. He was a, a study in himself. He was a character. I mean, Meatloaf obviously was a, a nom de, de stage. It was his stage name, but it was a character that he inhabited, absolutely larger than life, uh, and uh, and 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 big in all in, in all department. And I think he was forever proving himself to the world that he was bigger than all of them and he could survive and he could he could swing against any tide and that was his uh, part of his appeal i think that's what resonated with people you know that they they would go to the shows and he would put on this rampaging performance in defiance as it were of everybody else and that was part of his appeal really he went on to sell more than a hundred million albums Marvin Lee Day, better known as Meatloaf, was 74 years old. <laughs>